I was walking around the corner, shaking like a leaf. They grabbed it from me, took it away from me, turned it on. It says, yeah, sure. Tied it up and put it with a carrot. <laughs> no shit, man. This is a dangerous place. Dangerous place once again. No. I'm talking about Celeron. It's like celery of Ron and Bork. Celeron Bork. The, the carrot tape they impinged on the persona. He grabbed from me, took it away from me, turned it on, and it says, he held a gun to his head. Hey, what gun? Two policemen. Saleron was extruded by Carbon Hell with Shell, who lived introduced was introduced to me by Thaws Hodge, a neighbor of Sharon Samuels, Sally Treatment's daughter, on College Street, who um, got gave fed my father's cashmere coat to his dog after that he died. So they had implanted the the celery rabbit for Oswald's lucky lucky rabbit day and then they used it as a parameter control for him to navigate the, you know how flippy tune talks about how he uses people as barometers they're like the perfect storm q8 fires carbon hell flame over africa they were the flame over africa gang who tortured me as a child um just delivering the due dispatch to Robert F. Kennedy because he's talking about the situation. They used an implant to put up a, a Star Trek dummy as they beamed away with, you know, the cover story of the Beatles ripping off the British Museum. John Shulman was a distinguished citizen. Queerbite was a snitch. You get the idea, you know, and the, the puppet master says, please use a little reefer. They come out with pounds of reefer and say, do you want a little reefer career ball? And I really didn't want any, but they handed me the puff and I was sort of neurotoxin to their environment because I'm deaf. You know, deaf education is in a class of its own, the lower class, an epitome of neglect and ruin. They didn't even put me, they didn't even teach me sign language. They went after the girl who taught me sign language and, um, you know, um, did the um, Nordenberg nature of reality trip to her. They nature of reality to her for teaching me sign language. I mean, deaf education is in a class of its own, the bottom of the bottoms. And you beggars can't be choosers, you know. I didn't want to stand out like a sick, like a sick thumb, you know. I mean, but they, but they, they were, all, they were listening with their, with their war horn, you know. They have a big old war horn. They plan electrodes and queer balls brain. And they say, we're going to extrude. We put a rapid eye, what's that rapid eye movement? What's that rapid eye movement? And Brian Eno and Roger Waters come in. These were the people who claimed to be from Amnesty International. They set the whole thing up. Amnesty International, AI, stood for AIDS. Artificial Intelligence Death System. And they set up, you know, an extermination wardrobe. Literally. And they want they they take they these people preaching equity. Get this in UW dialectical preaching equity. Borrow me from school. <laughs> Steal my paintings because for for, for food. And then because they know they're worth tons of money because of the circumstances of the heist that they arranged. John Lennon's Houdini was a mega legacy heist, but that's all it was. None of them pulled a Houdini. I wish you were here to see it. Ha 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 ha.